Welcome to this short introductory video on handling our new Tigo Therm products for thermal insulation coatings. We will provide you with some helpful tips on how to handle our Tigo Therm binder and granules. You have received our sample kit containing Tigo Therm L300 binder and the granules Tigo Therm HPG 4000 and Tigo Therm HPG 6806. You may already have experience with thermal insulation coatings, but let me take the next few minutes to explain our new technology. We will demonstrate how to produce a thermal insulation coating, as well as what to consider and how to apply it. Here are three simple guiding formulations. On the left, the base is an acrylic resin. This styrene acrylic is a recommendation. If you have an in-house acrylic that you would like to use, please note that it is very important to test the storage stability of the entire coating. As you can see, the heat resistance increases from left to right. Tigo Therm L300 is a waterborne siloxane hybrid binder specifically developed for this type of application. It has almost no low molecular weight components, so the binder does not penetrate the porous particles and thereby create insulating properties. Using Tigo Therm L300 is the perfect way to achieve thermal stability above 150 degrees Celsius. In addition to the binder, polyvinyl alcohol serves as an important stabilizer for the entire coating system. We dissolve it in demineralized water before adding it to make it easier to incorporate. In all formulations, we have a combination of our granules, Tigotherm HPG 4000 and Tigotherm HPG 6806. Depending on the particle size of 300 micrometer and 30 micrometer, this is a perfect package to get as much air into your coating as possible to ensure a perfect insulating effect. This is only a formulation suggestion. Other combinations may be better suited to your needs, depending on the advantages of the two granules. To adjust viscosity, either demineralized water or fibers can be added, and to optimize film formation, 1% propylene glycol and 1% melamine resin can be pre-mixed with the acrylic resin. Careful incorporation of the granules is required. Here we use an inclined blade impeller, but propeller blades are also possible. Do not use a dissolver disc. After adding the combination of our acrylic binder and Tigo Therm L300, we add the polyvinyl alcohol solution. After homogenizing the liquid ingredients, carefully add the insulating granules. Due to the particle size distribution, homogenization of Tigo Therm HPG 4000 is essential before incorporation. A QR code can be found on the drum or container, which leads to a handling video. Start with a low shear rate and carefully increase it gradually to incorporate the particles. You will clearly recognize the stabilization of the incorporated air. The result is a smooth and foamy coating. Do not use any additives or co-solvents in this system. Defoamers and co-solvents will destroy the foam structure which is necessary for coating stabilization and insulating properties. Wetting and dispersing additives tend to wet out the hydrophobic particles and cause the entire formulation to become very thick. To improve adhesion and protection, it is recommended to pre-treat the metal substrate by sandblasting. A suitable primer is required for excellent corrosion protection. In addition to standard waterborne 2K epoxy primer, we recommended a high-quality heat-resistant primer based on silicophen AC900 and cured with Tigo Cure 100, which is ambient curing. Depending on the particle size of the insulation granules, it is recommended to apply the thermal insulation coating with a spray gun nozzle diameter of 3 to 5 mm. High-pressure application is recommended. Please avoid airless applications. To ensure a surface without cracks, it is recommended to apply several thin layers with intermediate drying. Thank you for your attention. If you have any further questions about our Tigo Therm products or their use, please don't hesitate to contact our team members directly. If you would like to learn more about Tigo Therm or any of our other products, please visit our website or join one of our learning sessions on Cotino campus.